bamboo lemurs are Madagascar's pandas, depending almost entirely on this overgrown grass for food. Bamboo is tough and woody, hard to chew, let alone digest. But hardest of all, the leaves of some species are packed full of cyanide. Yet three species of bamboo lemur live here, eating these plants day in, day out. Two of them favor parts of the plant low in poison. But the third, the golden bamboo lemur, is the real specialist. It eats the tips of new leaves that are loaded with cyanide. It's not known how they cope with the poison, but they can tolerate up to 12 times a normally lethal dose. Only through these subtle differences in diet can all three species share the same small patch of rainforest. Bamboo thrives here because this part of Madagascar is very wet throughout the year. And these lower eastern slopes are exposed to the full fury of the cyclone season. For a few months each year, these powerful tropical storms sweep straight in from the Indian Ocean. Lasting for days, they create paths of disruption across the island and pour huge amounts of water onto these forests. But for the bamboo lemurs, these dark clouds have a silver lining. In their wake, something peculiar starts springing up all over the forest floor. It's what the lemurs have been waiting for all year, bamboo shoots. The greater bamboo lemurs in particular find these spikes irresistible. These new shoots are particularly rich in sugary sap. It might take half an hour or more to consume a single shoot. These bamboo-loving primates are one of the most highly specialized animals to have evolved during Madagascar's long isolation. But this has left them vulnerable as their forest home disappears. As few as 1,000 of them now live in these dappled bamboo thickets. <laughs> 